if what you are trying here for something, then you will run out to try out a new um, appetite. Saturday. Happy Saturday! So it's Saturday and we are just getting ready to head out. We need to do our bulk meat, meat shopping. So it is that time again and this time we're also going to be going to the flea market to get some tomatoes. It's the harvest season. We still have some tomatoes but since we're it's the harvest season and we've already lost one month. This is currently September and we want to go see if we'll get the excellent pie. You know, people are buying bushels or have bushels for about $9 and the rest of it. Hopefully, we're able to get those baskets of tomatoes for way cheaper than we got them the last time. So, there is that. To be very honest, those are just the two things that we might be able to do today because I also want us to go to the mall, check out some things. I want to I want us to get our decorating over with. I just need to pick some items for storage and yeah, ornaments and stuff. So I want to go check home sense out because I have not done that all this while. Anyway, yesterday I went to the Ram on my way from work and I just now want to like out the things that I got. I don't need to show you all the things that I got because they're just regular stuff. I always say. Oh, but so once you find use for something, then you'll be running out. So this is the second time we got to another like this one. The first one lasted a month, and this one did not even last up to two weeks. So I got this one at Dollarama. I think this one was like one dollar and some change. Oh, three dollar fifty. And this one that I've been buying, I'm sure it's about fourteen dollars. So let us try this one out. I'll put this one out here. Oh, guys, it's not even gone out. I am already exhausted. Like I am so tired. So this one has our one and I also bought yeah so the things that I got that I have not not bought before I got raisins because I'm baking now <laughs> I bake these days so I'm gonna use this I'll probably add this also to the granola but I don't know if I can mix it up here Hi guys, just finally, you know, I'm just sitting down now since we came back. Obi and I, we sorted out all the meat. We just have the peppers to deal with later. So I'm gonna be eating some of the pizza from yesterday. So this pizza is actually from Pizza Hut. You guys saw, I think I have a clip from when I went to pick it up. 
someone suggested in my comment section months ago that I should try pizza oats that they have like the best pizza so far that he has tried in Canada so and we tried it and it is way better than what um we got the other time that's the last time we ordered pizza it was just it was a mess it was a disaster so um guys i don't know if this is the inflation thing <sighs> i didn't vlog all the things we got but the yam stood out to me so we went to try out a new um african food store Babe, this one is warm we bought so we went to the first the a new african food store and i asked for like a box how much their box of yam cost and they told me 190 dollars i'm like is it a bigger box because the box that i'm used to at the other place i usually go was um used to be 80 dollars so i'm like maybe this is a much bigger box and it was breaking it down for me and then when he told me that a quarter would be like three pieces i'm like and a quarter was 45 dollars and i used to buy eight tubers of yam for 40 dollars at the other place that's because the box came at the rate of 80 dollars so i'm like oh no don't worry so i thought we'll go to the other place and buy the yam because they also did not have turkey there so we'll buy the yam and we'll buy turkey. So I went to the usual place. Guys, turns out yam is now expensive and they doubled the price. This is so upsetting because it's expensive already as it was. And now tell me what type of inflation will cause the yam to the price of the yam to double. So more than double safe at this point. So now we bought like half box of yam for $80. So at this usual place it doubled but at the initial place we wanted to try and buy it it like it was more than times two so that's flour we have decided that we are not going to be eating yam as often as before i don't care like i'm going to go back to ice with for what it's just so annoying like, okay. i don't pour them on top so when you pour got it first <laughs> what was I saying? So like now we are not gonna be eating yam as frequently as possible, please. Like no. If only we had like a much bigger space, like that's the only issue here. We don't have space to store things. If I decide to cargo food stuff, the major thing I would like to cargo down here is yam because it is so awful because this is like yam season. If I was in Lagos, I know how I would be chopped yam. Eh? Anyway, let me not ramble too much, let me not rant about the food prices here because you know go in so i just want to close out the vlog here thank you so much for watching if you're experiencing this price hike in food wherever you are let us chat about it in the comment section Cons let's console ourselves a bit because it's it's crazy it is so crazy Whew. even the peppers that i bought like we didn't even get as good you know as the the price that we got was not as good as the last time and this is harvest time it's crazy anyway thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the vlog please do not forget to give it a thumbs up if you did give me a, leave me a comment as well below check out all that videos that you've missed share the video all that good stuff and i'll catch you on another video soon bye